I am three things. Very bad at coding, but trying to learn. Deeply neurotic and a fan of building Gundam model kits. And for all three of those things, the cyber fidget device seems kind of ideal to me. This is a little microcomputery device that you put together yourself from a kit, and it comes loaded with a bunch of little games you can develop for it. It's open source, and you can turn it into anything. It has Wi-Fi, it has Bluetooth, it has a speaker, a microphone, USB. So it can be anything from a voice recorder to a music player to a Pico web server to a penetration tester if you're willing to code it. There's going to be a whole sort of open source community and it will be loaded with some toys. But the idea is this is sort of a foundation for you to do cool things with. And that is really appealing to me. Especially because you can do cool things with it while just endlessly playing with these really clicky buttons. And it's machined aluminum. It feels really nice. It's got a little screen. You can have this stuff on it. It's a monochrome OLED with uh, color shields you put in to have different colors. But it's, it's just a neat gadget. It's a gadget. And I just really want to play with it. And eventually make apps for it. I'm learning Python. I'm getting there. It's taking time. I have some work to do. But I'm learning. And that's what this type of thing's for. For other cool future, weird, and just general gadgety tech, especially at CES, keep an eye on PCMag and all of our sibling sites.